previously on the Höge Kustenleden. We entered Kuleskoge National Park, one of the highlights of the High Coast Trail. Since it was a short hike, we could really enjoy the beautiful nature in the park and have a great time in a typical Swedish cabin next to a calm lake. From here we can already see the famous crevasse where we will be heading in this episode. To make things cozy, we build a fire and a lad had some yummy, yummy marshmallows. Burn. In eight episodes we are taking you along this beautiful trail. We are hiking through deep forest and mountaintop viewpoints, passing beautiful lakes that you only see in Sweden and sleeping in beautiful places along the way. Nowhere else in Sweden can you hike at these heights so close to the sea. Welcome to the Höga Kustenleden. Good morning! It's a beautiful day today. Yesterday and the day before it was raining like crazy, but today we woke up with a clear blue sky. It's quite chilly and windy, but it's logical when the weather is this great. We woke up with a beautiful sunrise at the lake and now we're packing our things. Today is the last day in the national park over here. Today we're going to the crevasse, the beautiful cave. From there it's about 15 kilometers to the next town where we will resupply and where we're gonna spend the night. We were the only ones in this beautiful place and had lots of time to explore the peaceful surroundings. But Skuleskogen National Park had more for us. Come on baby, take a leap of faith.
So we just arrived at our campsite and it was a beautiful, very sunny day. We really enjoyed it. Yeah, and right now we pitched our tent in a little village and it's next to the Skullesberg, one of the highlights of the Höcke Küstelede that's almost 300 meters high, the highest coastline in the world. And probably tomorrow we will climb that one, right? Yes, because the original trail doesn't go over the mountain, but just past the mountain. So today we passed the mountains and we quickly pitched our tent because we know tomorrow will be a very good day as well. So the plan is to go very light, leave one backpack here, pack one bag very light, go up the mountain, go back here, pack our stuff and continue the trail. And now it's time to have some dinner and then we will have an early night of sleep. On the next episode of the Höga Kustenleden. Dane embarked on an early start to ascend to the summit of Skullenberget. It's the Skullenberg detour. Skullenberget, I'm not sure how we pronounce it actually. This mountain has the highest coastline in the world, standing 286 meters above sea level. After the detour, we continued on a regular trail and passed the halfway point. Woohoo!